the leopard mentioned over and over again as the thing that's the toughest thing to face uh, if it's wounded especially they have this amazing ability to uh, flatten themselves to the ground and to find cover in almost any kind of terrain mm -hmm. I noticed that in an awful lot of the stories you tell about animal attacks, the animals tend to eat the faces off of the people that they attack. Why is that? It depends on what animal you're talking about, but it seems like dominance issues are a big part of it. For example, a case with the grizzly bear, when it comes at you, what it wants to stop is your, your claim of dominance, which you're unintentionally forwarding by looking at it. So it's going, to, it's going to hit your face if it can. With other animals like the chimpanzee, I, I was sort of surprised to find out that this had been known for well over 100 years, that chimpanzees would often bite the face and the hands off of their enemies. Really? And I say, yeah, and uh, when I say enemies, I mean specifically animals that they feel are threatening rather than their prey animals. When a chimpanzee fights a leopard, it'll try to bite the leopard's paws off.